Blender is a free open source 3D tool. I'm going to show you how to do 3D extruded text in simplified Chinese using Blender. All right, so we'll start with a fresh install. Okay, open up Blender and you'll see the default scene. I'll just click in the viewport and hit the delete key on the keyboard to remove the default cube. All right, and shift A to add some text. So here we go, some text. And you hit tab on the keyboard and that lets you edit this text. We're gonna want simplified Chinese in here. Hit tab again to exit edit mode. And before we do simplified Chinese, we need to use a, a different font. So we'll go over to the font tab and in the font section under regular, hit the browser button and you can browse to your simplified font. I'll use Windows fonts and I ha I've been using this FC Langhe true type font. All right, and with that loaded, we can copy and paste text from a text editor over to Blender. So again, hit tab to hit enter edit mode, remove the text that's there. I'll paste in the simplified Chinese text by using edit, paste clipboard, and there we go. Now we have our nice simplified Chinese text. With the cursor over the viewport, hit tab to exit edit mode. All right, so now we can manipulate the viewport. Middle mouse dragging will rotate the viewport. Scrolling the wheel will zoom in. And shift and middle mouse button will pan the viewport. Now over in the geometry section of the font tab, we can use the extrusion tool. Now we can increase the values in the extrude field by clicking and dragging. All right, and if I middle click drag in the viewport, you can see that the 3D text has been extruded. There's also depth, so if I click and drag that one, that will adjust the beveling. And then there's resolution, which increases the resolution of the beveling. Okay, and then click and drag. And now we have a nice extruded simplified Chinese font. At this point, you can go to File, Export, and export to the various formats supported by your typical game engine. All right, well, thanks for watching.